and tales for dark nights. The following performance is a first round entry in the Evil Idol competition, in which the winner of the contest will become a permanent member of the Chilling Tales for Dark Nights voice acting team. Listen to the entire performance, and if you'd like to see this particular contestant advance to the second round, which begins August 1st, simply click the thumbs up icon to vote in their favor. If you don't care for the performance, click the thumbs down icon instead. Thanks for listening and for participating, and good luck to all of our first round contestants. The Idiot's Guide to the End of the World Written by G.G. Collins Performed by Stephen Muir For Chilling Tales for Dark Nights and the Evil Idol Competition 1. If the world is ending, your first goal is to determine why. Zombies? Aliens? Nuclear war? Giant meteors? Flesh-eating nanobots? Understanding the threat early will improve your odds. 2. Ditch your friends and family next, preferably before they die in your arms. The apocalypse is not the time to deal with emotional baggage. 3. Find a group of plucky survivors with a wide range of skills, but more importantly, none of them should be better looking than you. This way, the others will instinctively trust you and value your good genes. The only exception is if the group happens to include one beautiful person who is a true idiot. Beautiful idiots make excellent distractions when they die screaming, thus allowing everyone else to escape. 4. Cultivate your common sense. Authoritative leaders go crazy, super-intelligent nerds get smacked down by hubris, and heart-of-gold badasses get eaten while being stupidly heroic. Common sense will save your ass. 5. Befriend an animal. Their hisses and growls may come in handy, but don't get too attached. See tip number two. Six. At the darkest moment, abandon all common sense to chase after the smallest, most wildly improbable hope you can find. You'll only get one shot at this, so time it perfectly, or risk becoming the beautiful idiot. Seven. The message goes on from there. It's almost amusing for spam. Looking up from your phone, however, you notice the people around you are all looking over each other's shoulders and comparing screens. Did they all get the same bing, 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 bing? Dozens of message alerts go off at once. You look down again. Fun's over. Get ready. Thanks for listening. If you haven't already, don't forget to cast your vote for this contestant via a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Thanks for voting and for spreading the word about Chilling Tales for Dark Nights and our first ever Evil Idol competition. Tune in August 1st, 2016 for the start of round two. Chilling Tales for Dark Nights.